Hey, uh, so uh, it's Tom here, and uh, I'm gonna do something I don't normally do, which is actually uh, talk to my videos. Um, so I wanna talk about um, skateboard progression and skateboarding. So I don't know if you're really a, a you know a follower for a while or just checking out this video randomly, but um, I used to do way more skateboarding content, uh, just taking around my iPhone or whatever and uh, filming more skateboarding. But in, uh, in a recent times, I'm doing uh, more life stuff. There's way more people than I thought would be here. It's kind of fun. Everyone's out today. It's a good day. But um, I used to start transitioning over more to uh, life videos because that's just what I thought more applied to me. Especially in the winter seasons, it was like, that's what I, you know. You know, like, skateboarding doesn't always resume in all seasons. You know, in winter, you're stowed away. But life keeps going on. And uh, I wanted to... I think the goal of my videos has transferred over time as well. Um, from, you know, just like hyping myself up and watching my cool skateboard tricks to documenting life and moments in time. That's what my videos are now entirely actually, is they're just they're just flashback montages of whatever the past months have looked like. Um, this type of video doesn't really excite me as much because it's always just such a big process to go into. So we're trying something different today with an actual more geared topic. I might cut this out. But so let's talk about skateboarding though. It's been a part of my YouTube channel and videos for a while now, but um, I kind of dropped off. Not only did it drop off from my videos, but also me doing it in life too. Uh, I just went out a lot less. Um, I just found other things I enjoyed doing that were easier to do that didn't hurt as much. You know, I, just between all the ankle injuries and wrist injuries I've had, it's not always like a fun time going on for a session. And the other thing too that I wouldn't want to admit right away is um, progression. I just haven't progressed in skateboarding very much afterwards. Like after, I think in 2020 was probably when I was doing my best tricks, probably. And um, I was a little bit bummed after because I just didn't learn anything new hardly, especially with the half pipe, especially flat ground tricks. I was actually losing tricks, I was dropping off. And it just wasn't, it, was, it wasn't exciting, I guess. So I stopped doing it as much, still here and there, because I, I do truly enjoy it. And that's why I do it. But, you know, I think it's like, it's okay not to, you know, Especially when you compare yourself to others, it's okay to not be doing as good as they are at skateboarding or learning as many new tricks. Because overall, I just like doing it because it was fun. And um, it still is. But now I want to challenge myself to do more, I guess. I've always challenged myself of what I can do, which is do it better and better. But now I like really want to do that, I guess. Especially back when 80s. They're a weird trick to me. I'm starting to have them right now for some reason. But I just want to improve on my skateboarding and do better. And include in my videos as well too. I think if I make my things, if I make what I attempt to do more poignant, more dedicated or focused on one thing, I think I'll enjoy doing it more and it'll be more fun to put together as well. So yeah, I think a, a topic of just like progressing in skateboarding or doing stuff with skateboarding, I think it's okay to not be learning new tricks, bam, 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 but just that you enjoy it and that you're trying and that you want to get better, I guess, that you want to keep having fun as a sport. I think that's great. And that's what I plan on doing. So yeah. Back to life videos though. 